How are we doing out there? First things first, my name is Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using the Ambient Light Rejection Technology Gain times 4, 5, and 7. Now, this is part two. I was going to do it yesterday, but I already did enough videos already from the door. Didn't want to bug everybody from time to time getting notifications from me here and there. But I got a lot to offer and a lot to show. So, um, this is the piece of drywall already dried and ready to go for the next demonstration, which I'm about to show you right now. Also, too, we're going to be making some changes to our K&A projector package kits. Um, I'm going to add the 235.1 with the ViewSonics are completely sold out, no more of those left. Um, and we have one of the wallpaper screens that came with two wallpaper screen setups is sold out also too, so we're removing those off the website. Um, also too, I think we got a Black Bend Q, that one sold about two days ago, I should have been removed that one from the site, sorry about that. Um, also I'm showing you what we have now. So this right here, I got boxes going out today. And I still have more orders to go. I got about 60, 70 orders going out today on the new paint. So, yes, it was a success uh, with the new um, Supreme 7. This is what we're using right now, Supreme 7, on my um, NEC 720p projector. So, what we're going to do is we're going to add in... Now, mind you, people have been asking us, are we going to come out with a Supreme 7 wallpaper projection screen? Yes, we are. And we're going to actually, with K&A, we're going to package the Panasonic. We got another Panasonic in. The other one sold. We have the WXGA Panasonic projector at 3,000 lumens, uh, 720p. As you know, 720p looks incredible on our screens. Um, you don't have to have 4K or 1080p if you choose. You don't need it. You don't have to have it. But anyway, so this comes with the remote control. We got another remote control. We got everything in. Another package in for this one because the Panasonic sell very fast. This one's going for around $548. It will come with a Supreme pre-coated wallpaper screen. Mind you, those wallpaper screens are not going to be out for another two more days because we're still working with the manufacturer to get more of those uh, surfaces. This right here is an ultra short throw projector that will be going up also too. With, and it also will come with a Supreme wallpaper projection screen. I'm just yanking out the lamp. The lamp was perfectly fine, but I wanted a brand new lamp in here, so I just ordered a new one with the remote control. So this is an ultra short throw with HDMIs. This right here is an Epson uh, 470. Like I said, I don't keep my projectors long. Uh, not, not particular ones. Ultra short throws, I don't keep that long because like I said, I get more of a throw out of a long throw because it's more of a challenge, so I don't keep these. But I did keep one for myself, which I have over here. That's my other one. I'm not getting rid of that one. I need that one very badly for other, other demonstrations. All right, so um, this projector is sold. It's already out the door. That was part of the 235.1 package. The last one, they are gone. All right, so let's start the demonstration and show you how the drywall came out now that it's fully dried. And you can see exactly how amazing this stuff is. For those you've been asking me questions about, can I paint this on drywall? Well, here you go. Now, the screen behind it is actually made of a blackout cloth material, and this is the drywall. And that's my elevating screen. That's why it looks like it's not even attached to anything. I have already ordered the, uh, the heavyweight um, cable, so I can basically, invisible cable, so I can hang it from the ceiling. Because I had fishing line, but the fishing line didn't do too well, it broke, and I should have got a heavier gauge. Alright, so let's grab us another demonstration. I love the levitating screen. It is the coolest thing ever. It really looks like the screen is actually floating. I'm putting one in my gaming room. Now I'm thinking about, I may do like a levitating screen package that'll come with the LED lights, that'll come with the hardware, everything you need to actually make your screen float. It's not gonna come with the wood, sorry, but it'll come with the brackets and everything with it. So we might make it, I might start it today. I might do a levitation no, I have to do it tomorrow. I have to do it tomorrow. Maybe Monday or Tuesday I have to set that one up because I got work to do today. I'm not going to have time to get to it. But I think we're going to do a levitation kit that allow you to be able to have everything needed to make the screen float. And of course, I'll put tutorial videos on the website. So you can go to the website and put a link in there. Go to the website and they'll show you how to do it. I love showing the angle because you just see where it's not connected to the wall at all. Yeah, 
Yep, that is the drywall. And I'll do, well, let me do something with the lights on, something with the lights off. I'm trying to do equally for both. And keep in mind, the projector I'm using in the demonstration is only 720p. It's not 4K, it's not, it's not a 1080p. And it's only it's a 720p projector. I think I said it's only 1080p. I'm sorry. It's only um it's only the projector 720p. It's not 1080p. You can look it up for yourself. It is a NEC MP1150. They are around. They're 720p projectors. All right. Let's take the lights out. I'll bring the video back a little bit because I know we're going to miss some of it while I walk around here shutting lights off. Let me see. Try to get it as dark as possible. You can see I got a lot of lights to go through. And I've got two lights here or there. I got a lot of lights to go through. So let's go back a little bit. That screen really looks like it's floating, doesn't it? That is so cool. I love it. A little internet interference. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Pause it just a bit. Sometimes you gotta pause it. All right. Look how beautiful that looks. This is on drywall. Keep in mind, this is on a unsanded, no prime piece of drywall. All right, let's get those lights back on again. Because like I said, lights off for me is too easy. I mean, even with lights on with this technology is too easy because like I said, these screens are used to producing images outside. So, you know, inside lighting is very easy for this kind of technology. You know, it's used to being outside. Is this light plugged in? It's plugged in. Hold on, let me turn this one on too. And they're used to being outside and a lot of ambient light. Like I said, you can't get any more brighter than outside. My lights. This is how many lights I have in the environment. Whew, got a lot in here. It's a bit of a workout walking through here, turning on lights. All right. See, we got to go. See how many lights I have in the environment. It's a lot of walking around. Well, not a lot, but I'm just saying. It's a bit of walking around, just getting all the lights turned on. Get it nice and bright in here again. the angle gain. Oh, 
All right, that's why I'm grabbing all bright, beautiful color, beautiful scenery, because there's no point in doing demonstrations with contrast because the screens are black. Now, like I said, with the K and A um, setups, we are going to add two forms in there. Now, you have a choice. With the, right now, with the new screens coming out, the Supreme Sevens coming out, we are going to make it where we're going to bring it with a um, with these two projectors. We're going to automatically have um, with these two projectors. We're automatically going to have a wallpaper screen by um, Supreme, a Supreme Seven wallpaper screen. Now, mine this is a pre-coated screen. There's no painting involved. Take it out of the box, stick it on the wall, and you're done. That's basically about all you have to do. Turn your projector on, you're done. We'll do a couple of demonstrations on that screen showing you what it's going to look like. Um, also, too, um, with the other new K&A projectors we have coming in, we're going to do those differently. We're going to have something where you can have a choice of having the superior, I mean supreme, or it's the superior, sorry, superior, get those mixed up. A superior roll-on, which you have an object, if you can get a much bigger screen because these projectors do much larger sizes, or it will come with a wallpaper. You have a choice of which one you want. Wallpaper um, as a 4x8, which is a Supreme 7, or you can basically have the Superior at um, a um, one quart that would paint a screen size of 120 inches. And that'll be a real one. All right, if my time runs out here, first things first, I'm Kenneth Bird. I'm the creator of Illuminous 4K Screen Paint using ambient light projection, technology gain times four and five and seven. Keep forgetting that one. Hope you enjoyed the video demonstration on our updates, what's to come. Our ultra short though projector should be on the site probably tomorrow or maybe the day after that once I get the lamp in here and show them do a demonstration on the lamp. And also too, uh, once I get the remote control in because I had to order a new remote control for it. And the Panasonic will be on the site tomorrow because the other one we had on there is sold out. So I got to mark that sold out or out of stock. And that's how beautiful that drywall looks. Just like when we did a Superior. We did a Superior on drywall. That stuff looked incredible. This spray on version of a Superior. One of the highest white levels in a black screen. Thank you all for your time. I gotta go.